In this video, we will review how to create and use summary views. So we're in a project navigator and let's go to the third tab in this view called summary view. Now, summary views are a great way to combine several projects into one space and view, which allows managers to look across their team if they want to see the bigger picture of what work has been assigned. And also if you want to look across a number of projects or campaigns to understand the progress and status of work. So inside our summary view window here, you'll see that there's three um, already created summary views. And this is set for calendar, team and status across all team members. So let's take a quick look at this calendar view right now. And you can see here, I have a view of all team members for work that's happening in December and January. And by coming to my team, I can see all of the work assigned to everybody in my team in my space across all the different projects. And finally, the status view here shows me all the work across my teams and its current status. So let's go ahead now and create our own summary view. We need to click create summary view and it will open the creation model. And this is where we provide the settings for our view. So I'm going to give it a quick name. I'm going to call it status for social because I'm going to use this for my stand ups. The first thing we pick is our view type. I'm going to go ahead here and click table view. And there's three principal filters that we can use within summary views, and that is the people or the members we wish to see, the labels, which we wish to see, and also the projects. And you can set these up by using only one in the three examples we saw before, or by combining different um, settings. So what I want to see is I want to see all members in here, so I'm not going to pick anything in particular. I also want to see all labels, so I could select them, but in this instance, I will not. And finally, I will set some project settings. So let me scroll down, deselect them all. So let's clear that, pop down. And like I said, I want to see these social campaigns here. So let's tick that and I have selected them. I also want to set by priority and allow work on weekends. And for now, I'm just going to keep this view with just me. So when I click done, you'll see that inside my project navigator, the summary view has been created and it's also pinned to my left hand navigation. And one distinct thing to remember here is a summary view will have a ring and a project will have a solid circle on your left hand nav. So let's go ahead and open up my summary view now. And you can see I have a list of all of the action cards by project across all of the team in this social space. And that is how we create a summary view in Hive.